you guys, I'm Natasha. And I'm Naomi. And welcome to Chem 1F92. We're going to show you how to get to the Chem assignment boxes and give in your assignment without having to get lost in Mackenzie Town. Hi Chem 1F92, my name is Naomi and this is the information desk. If you ever get lost, lose something, or find something that's lost, you bring it here. But hopefully you won't get lost. We're going to show you how to get there. Now we're walking down the hallway that leads towards the entrance to Mackenzie Town, which is a really, really complicated building in the beginning. But don't worry, I believe in you. Over here is the Tim Hortons. It's a very important landmark. It'll help you get around the school and not get lost. And uh, hopefully that won't happen too many times. <laughs> Behind us is the orange staircase. Now it's really important. Once you've found this staircase, you're golden. There's antimony, arsenic, aluminum, selenium, and hydrogen, and oxygen, and nitrogen, and rhenium, and nickel, neodymium, neptunium, germanium, and iron, americium, ruthenium, uranium, europium, zirconium, lutetium, vanadium, and lanthanum, and osmium, and astatine, and radium, and gold, protactinium, and indium, and gallium, and iodine, and thorium, and thulium, and thallium. There's yttrium, ytterbium, actinium, rubidium, and boron, gadolinium, niobium, iridium, and... We are standing at the entrance of B-block right now. And uh, we're going to show you how to get your assignment boxes. So when you're standing here, this way, General Hall Faculty of Business leads to the bookstore, which is the way you do not want to go when going to the assignment boxes. This is the way you want to go, through B Block. We're currently at the entrance to B Block. Now, there are a lot of intersections in this building, so it's really important to keep in mind where you are and where you're turning. If you keep walking a little bit this way and look to your right, you'll see the psychology department. That's the wrong way to go. Thanks for letting me almost run into the couch. Oh, I'll try. <laughs> okay. <laughs> too late, too late. <laughs> All right, so now you've reached E block. And you're also going to pass this pinkish wall. Once you pass that, you know you're on the right way. Follow me. Uranium and silicon and silver and samarium and bismuth, bromine, lithium, beryllium and barium. Now you've reached uh, the nice little window here where a lovely bunch of ladies work. Please don't ask them for help. They're very nice, but they truthfully don't know anything about your assignment boxes. Pass that. You'll come uh, near Dr. Payone's office. Dr. Payone is the senior lab coordinator for first years. And he's a very nice guy. If you ever need uh, help or have any questions for him, feel free to knock on his door. He's more than willing to help. And uh, now we're going to continue down this hallway and turn. There's holmium and helium and hafnium and erbium and phosphorus and francium and fluorine and terbium and manganese and mercanium, molybdenum and magnesium, dysprosium and scandium and cerium and cesium and lead, praseodymium and platinum and plutonium, palladium, promethium, potassium, polonium and tantalum, technetium. All right, and now you've reached your chem assignment boxes. These boxes right here are for Chem 1F92, and if you're in the other chemistry class, Chem 1P00, your lab box is right here. If you live in residence, the queue is right behind us. We're standing at the ultimate entrance to the chemistry boxes. This is the entrance to E and F block. Uh, if you're uh, in biology or need to see a biology professor, this is the entrance you would take as well. Uh, we're going to walk in through these doors, hang a right, and show you how to get there by walking up the stairs. Titanium, tellurium, and cadmium, and calcium, and chromium, and curium. There's sulfur, californium, and fermium, and berkelium, and also mendelevium, einsteinium, nobelium, and argon, kryptonium, and radon, xenon, zinc, and rhodium, and chlorine, carbon, cobalt, copper, tungsten, tin, and sodium. These are the only ones of which the news has come to Harvard, and there may be many others, but they haven't been discovered. Remember this door? This is Dr. Payon's office. So now from here on, you're going to go this way. There's holmium and helium and hafnium and erbium and phosphorus and francium and fluorine and terbium and manganese and mercanium, molybdenum, and magnesium, dysprosium and scandium and cerium and cesium and lead, praseodymium and platinum, and plutonium, palladium, promethium, potassium, polonium and tantalum, technetium, titanium, tellurium and cadmium and calcium and chromium and curium. There's sulfur, californium, and fermium, berkelium, and also mendelevium, einsteinium, nobelium, and argon, kryptonium, radon, xenon, zinc, and rhodium, and chlorine, carbon, cobalt, copper, tungsten, tin, and sodium. These are the only ones of which the news has come to harm.